What's up everyone? Dan my man ZGI here and welcome back to more Let's Play Earthbound. Earthbound. The last episode we um took down or got all the way to Tucson and stopped talking to no one. Um and uh we leveled up to level 13 and those are my stats right there. And we stayed at the hotel last, get a message at, from Paula, and in this episode we're gonna um Head out and try to find her. But first... P -p 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 Paul, where are you? It's time for a yummy piece of pie. Yeah, I hate to be... <clears throat> that guy's kid. But anyway. So in the last episode, um... Uh... Everdread said that, uh... There was a... Um, that they... That he saw Paula being taken away by a fat kid and a um, guy in a blue suit. And they were heading uh, east of here. And Paula said that she could hear water wherever she was. So I said that we go and try and look for her. Um, I don't. Yeah, you know, no, I already rested up, so I don't. I, I shouldn't need any healing up or anything. Uh, that what, what's really strange about that. Uh, that path to this cave is that um usually it's infested with rambling evil mushrooms but I didn't see anything ah new enemy this is a mobile sprout mobile sprouts can be kind of nasty they can um sink in their roots and oh, nuts I'm missing already they can sink in their roots and um sprout somewhere else uh, uh, if you're strong enough that you can take them, take them down easy peasy. They have PSI Magnet, which is a move that Ness can't learn. Ooh! Nice. I have both these guys. Um, let's see here. What's it? Ness! Stop missing! Dude! Alright, mobile sprout A, stop moving, and STOP USING PARASITE MAGNET! Dude, come on. There we go. One more hit, should it take him out here. STOP IT! No! Alright, you know what? Here. Taste my rockin'. Ah. Are you kidding me? I didn't kill it? Alright. Dude! Oh, man. Okay, that fight took way longer than it needed to. Hold on here. Let's um, let's heal up here. If I were, if I were a smarter man, I would have leave and look for a magic butterfly, which might be a good idea. Actually, I think if you get mushroomized here, um, this girl here, who's hunting for mushrooms, will um, take them off your head. I think. I think she gives you something for it too. So we're gonna head up here and try to avoid those. Okay, um, I'm gonna try that trick that I told you about leaving, leaving an, oh! Leaving an area and coming back and reloading the screen. Okay, get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, no, 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 Okay, I do not want to fight those things right now. We really like a magic butterfly. Ah, bingo! Okay, I think I can take on anything that comes my way now. I don't do a lot of yelling and screaming in this video. I don't like it. Okay, so that bridge is out in. I'll fight this guy. It's a new enemy here. This is a little UFO. A little UFO. Yeah, anyway. Okay, so this thing has a couple of different attacks that I'm not too happy with. You can fire a beam, uh, a couple different beams. Uh, one of which actually gives Ness a cold. There's nothing that he can't 
it does damage to him every once in a while. And oh, paralysis alpha, yes. And um, I think it has PSI too. Now this thing, um, it's a pencil-shaped iron statue blocking the path. Well, nuts. That was her only way into the into peaceful rest valley. So I guess we won't be able to get in. Can we check the sign? Yeah. So, yeah, we can't cross this bridge, we can't continue on, so might as well go home. So, now let's see what this guy has to say anyway. Okay, your regular mall. Yeah, 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 survive. Um, no, I, I've already explained how, how to do that, so, yeah. He explains how to survive battles. Okay. Uh, cutting it. Alright, that mobile sprout actually, um, dropped a croissant. I'm gonna eat that now. Max up my HP. You know, the usual good stuff. And actually, if we head out here now, we're gonna get into a fight with a rambling eagle mushroom and a mobile sprout. And I'm just gonna try and end this real quick with a rockin' alpha. I'm gonna have to cut it. But yeah, the real annoyance about those mobile sprouts is that they have PSI Magnet, which... Oh. Apple Kid. How's it going? Finished work on the great invention. This thing is so cool. See you soon, Slam. Beep. Okay, I'm pick up this. And to be perfectly honest with you, I don't like fighting rambling evil mushrooms. Oh, wow, another one. Do I, do I need that? Um, no, I do not. Actually, hold on here. No, I don't need it. I'm fully healed and everything, so, yeah. Oh, so we're gonna head back into town. Now, actually, um... Uh, God, what am I trying to say? So, Orange Kid is here, and if you have the money, you can actually, like, pay for him to help you out, but he doesn't do anything important. So, Apple Kid isn't here. So we're gonna have to go and look for his fat ass. Damn it. Actually, uh, we don't wanna go that way. That's that's the road to Threed, actually. We don't wanna go to Threed. We wanna head this way. Head up here. Head through here. Now, I don't remember exactly how you're supposed to know this, but, um... He's actually hanging out in Berglund Park. Finally, the pencil eraser is ready. This machine will eradicate all pencil-shaped figures in just one second. It's incredibly powerful. Just don't use it near a shop that sells pencils. It Here, it's yours now. So, we get the pencil eraser, which is kind of nice. So, if he comes up with any other, other inventions, he'll call us. That's what the receiver phone is for. You can't make calls with it, but you can most definitely, um, receive calls. Uh, duh. Anyway. Um, so now we have a means of getting to Peace of Rest Valley, which is very nice. So actually what I'm going to do right now, um, instead of me walking all the way back through that cave and all the way back up that way, uh, fighting enemies along the way, um, I'm gonna cut it here, and I'll resume back when, uh, I'm over by the, um, the pencil-shaped statue, so I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, and actually, I only got into one fight on the way, way there, so, um, so whenever, um, to get past this, you go into your inventory, use pencil eraser. For some weird reason, the iron pencil statue was erased, and it disappears from existence forever, which is very nice. Now, if you head up here, um, oh, another note. You get treated to this. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, you ready for an excellent memory? Look at the camera. Ready? Say, photographs! And we get our picture taken again. What a great photograph. It'll always bring back the fondest of memories. And he disappears again. Actually, is this... 
No, this isn't where I wanted to go. Um, I thought there was a present around here. Whoa! Okay, these guys. You do not want to fight them. They are bad news. You run into one of those and you are going to die. I guarantee it. Stick to mobile sprouts and little UFOs and things like that for now. Um, there'll be a time when you can come back here and uh, train up here. And that actually isn't too far from now. I don't know why they call this Peaceful Rest Valley, man. This place is deadly as hell. Actually, let's hit up here. There's a present up here that we can get. Travel Charm! Alright, I'm going to our Eclipse here. And I do believe it's... Is it our body? Yes! Okay, so now our defense is up to 24 now, which is nice. Uh, let's head down this way. Um... Actually, let's head back up. I don't want to fight that guy. That tree is bad news, like I'm telling you. You do not want to fight that tree. Get away. Get away. Get away. Bad. <laughs> that thing is bad news, I tell you. Look, capsule inside. Got too much stuff? Okay, let's, um... Let's see here. An exit mouse. Broken machine. Pencil... Uh, for sake of, um, actually, I don't think I can drop anything. Let's just eat. Alright. Let's, oops, let's take the, uh, luck capsule out and drink it. Luck one up by one. Alright, no enemy. Oh, wow, I got a back attack on it. Spinning Robo. Alright, let's bash it on the head here. These things are pretty tanky, so, yeah, and, and plus they, they, they do have PSI shields. But I'm going to break his defenses with a smash attack. Smash his face with an iron! Yeah, so, they're, they're not too bad, I guess. I mean, they're not as bad as the, um, those tree enemies. Alright, that spinning robo actually ended up uh, casting a shield on its first turn, and I ended up having to um, just do a PSI rock on it, to break its defenses, and then I ended up getting a smash attack on it, which is kind of funny. Actually, let's see here. Um, I think we're going to be fine. Ah, nuts! Ow! Oh, that was that was nice actually. Let's do another PSI rock in there. This place is crawling with magic butterfly butterflies. Butterflies! Wow, I'm oh, wow, it didn't work on the little UFO. Alright, let's you know what let's Ah oh, Nas caught a cold. This sucks. Alright, I'm gonna have to No, quit dodging! Every attack. Oh, nuts. Dude, I'm gonna be pissed if. Dude, don't die. Okay, cool. Quit firing beams at me. Oh, I hate little UFOs. Ah! See, the thing is, is that you do not want to, um, use Life of Alpha here, because you need to heal. Ow! Finally! What? No! I thought he died. Okay, there we go. God! <laughs> Skip sandwich! I'm level 15 now, hooray! Guts went up by two. Vitality went up by one. Gonna get some HP. Went up by 12. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, PPF went up by two. I guess I'm kind of still in therapy. Shock. Shock therapy from the level up I got from Captain Strong. I think that's one of the best level ups I've ever gotten in this game, by the way. Well, let's see here. So Ness has got a cold. Try healing Alpha. And Ness gets over his cold. Yeah, if only I could do that in real life. That'd be something, huh? 
Let's use my PSI powers to, you know, get over a cold. Let me kick ass. All right. I no, never mind. Let's head out this way. Oh no 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 no! Get away! Get away! The thing is, is with those trees, is that they can freaking run at you, which is terrifying. I think he's gone. Yeah. Yeah. Just use that um that re that screen reload trick that I showed, and you should be fine with that. Those guys are something that you do not want to mess with. I'm gonna heal here. See, what, like I said before, like Pisaurus Valley is crawling with magic butterflies. Like you could pretty much abuse life up all you want here. I do believe there's a present over this way if you go far enough. Um, yes, there is. Right here. It's a hard hat. All right. So we got something to finally replace the um, Mr. Baseball cap. So now we um, got higher defenses and just be able to take major or take more damage from those. Um, not take more damage, uh, defend more damage against those the enemies around here. Huh. There's a house down there. Weird. Is that a spiteful crow? It's a spiteful crow. Now I heard somewhere that you can um glitch the game where like if things are at ledges like that you can actually get into fights with things on ledges. Whether you're on the top or the bottom level. I'm not you know, I've never had it happen before, but you know, people do say that that can happen. Let's just use rock in here. Put that UFO there. You know what? I don't even know why I was talking during that part. I'm going to cut that out anyway. All right. I do believe there's more presents over there, but we can come back later and get those. We're gonna, we want to head through this cave here. <laughs> oh, wow. There's a snake. How threatening. I've been able to take these out with one shot since one act. What? I don't know how that happened. We're not even facing each other. Weird. All right. Welcome to Happy Happy Village. I'm going to end things off here, guys. And in the next part, we're going to explore Happy Happy Village. So I guess if you like this part, rate, comment, subscribe, share this video, do whatever the hell you want. This has been Dynamite Man, ZGI, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care, y'all.